three or four years. It started out pretty slow. It's been cooking, I would say, a little bit longer, just like, because it's with Adobe Books. As they were forming, I went and was like, hey, would you guys be interested in getting together like a Books to Prisoners project? I had heard about this program that was going on in the East Bay. They've been doing it for decades. And I had heard about that and I was like, oh, that'd be cool to, you know, kind of work something out with that and, and maybe through Adobe Books. And then, and then I met this guy kind of randomly at the same time. Um, this guy, David, has been doing it for decades also on his own renegade out of Valerium Books in San Francisco. He was kind of like a little bit of a mentor for me. Like we would meet and he would just kind of check in and then he had some extra little, like he'd be like, oh hey, I have a couple letters that I can't handle, you know, answering. And then so he'd lay them on me. He let folks know that they could contact me or um, the folks that he was already working with. And then anyone knew, you know, he'd, he'd send them our way. So it kind of, we, I ended up, we ended up at Adobe taking over kind of the project that had been going on for, for decades. Like there's, yeah, I don't know how many people are through that, but definitely kind of carrying that on. Dude, I also want to tell you today, it was like, I was in the zone picking these books. It was so insane. Like, this might be the best. I was just like, oh my God, I have the perfect thing, you know? I think you know the genre of books I enjoy, such as memoirs of gay authors and also good travel books, like travel memoirs. I recently read a very good book by such and such, blah, blah, blah. And then what I, and then I was like, check this out. I found Close to the Knives. Mm -hmm. Do you know this guy, David? Mm -mm. Uh, what did you know of it? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I've He's heard like of him. classic Lana, gay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Say, gay memoir. Uh-huh. Like, yeah. Totally. And David Sedaris. Uh -huh. And then this is a, like a travel with yeah. Elizabeth Gilbert. Mm -hmm. I know. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Love it was just classic. like, boom. Like, how to make paper airplanes, calligraphy, or end of the world books. Right? Wow. With some origami paper. Yeah. So that's my... <laughs> so that's look, there's yeah. almost, actually almost airplanes in here, but yeah. it turns into other things. In the field of counseling, drug and alcohol addictions, criminal behavior, paths to recovery. Nice. And he books along those subjects. Also, he wanted a college dictionary and a thesaurus. Yeah, sometimes it says college dictionary. He said college or Oxford, and uh -huh. I had an Oxford. Yeah. And then a nice Roger. But treating addictive and mental health conditions, I was like, mm -hmm. that, there yeah, we go. Yeah, that's perfect. I know. I was just like, I don't know how this is happening, but this is cool. <laughs> <laughs> it's like... You know, I kind of keep it pretty simple. I try and pay attention to like if they are into a project and they're like, oh, hey, I'm working on my poetry and I would like this kind of book or I'm doing like I'm into drawing and this and that and try and just be supportive of the, their interests like hey good luck with your you know your writing or whatever or, you know and there's also there's been people like a, a couple people that maybe a handful that I would consider like it's almost like a friendship like this one I got today I was just thinking about him today and I was like man what happened to you know no I haven't heard from him and then I went to pick up the letters today and there was one from him and he's just like, hey, my friend, I know I haven't written in a while. And it, it does start to feel like you have this, you know, little, like a sweet little friendship, you know, just like the smallest things and people will be just like so lovely, you know, just like so grateful and so just like, like this one guy, he sent me um, this, this letter. This, you know, I'm sending you the essence of internal balance and external protection to you and yours each day. You know, stuff like that and then like with a little picture and just like really sweet. Um, yeah, folks are really, it's, it's, it's really like nice to hear from folks and, and it's also like this one guy a um, couple people have come to the bookstore after they're out and they're like, oh man, you know, I just wanted to come say thank you because, you know, the books that you guys have been sending has just like really, really got me through it, you know, and that's real. I haven't 
had anyone say what they have done, but people definitely be, people be like, I'm, you know, I'm 26 years old. I've been in here for nine years or just like crazy. And I'll be here for this much more time. You know, um, people right from, from the, um, the shoe, it's called special housing unit, which means, um, solitary down in the hole. You know, I've had lots of requests from there and you're just like, whoa. And yeah, people that are in there for a long time. I, I feel honored to do it. it. It's like, it brings me a lot of joy to, you know, put things together for someone and be like, oh, I think they'll like this, you know, because it's like, you get to kind of pick out something special that you think they'll like, and then make it into something that'll be like nice to receive. And it feels, yeah, it feels awesome. Thank you.